Heart disease is the leading cause of death, but it's not a given. While there are some things you can't change, risk factors like family history, there are things that you can do to help prevent it. Dr. Nitza Alvarez, cardiologist at the Tri-County Heart Institute, believes that education is the key to prevention. In her book, Heels vs. Ties, she particularly advocates for women whose signs and symptoms for cardiovascular disease are very different than that of their male counterparts. We caught up with Dr. Alvarez as she made her way through Lake County in February during American Heart Month, sharing her passion for education on our country's number one killer of both men and women. This month has been fantastic. We are being very busy. As you know, February is Heart Health Month, so we are trying to be, spread the word, creating awareness of heart disease, still the number one killer in America, still the number one killer for women. I have been in a few uh, events in the community. Uh, through Lempar, we have a few meetings with women in the community. This one is one of my biggest events this month. It's Health versus Tide, the presentation of my book. I wanted to make it a fun girls night out because I think it's easier for people to come and feel that they belong. I treat my patients like family and I think that when you just go out to spend time with friends and family, it makes it fun. And tonight we're going to learn at the same time that we're having fun. Having the girls bring their friends, their girlfriends, and that way we have more women here to be able to spread the world in our community. My youngest daughter and my oldest daughter are also patients of Dr. Alvarez's and so we just thought it would really be interesting to come and hear what she has to say and we're thankful that she always makes time to talk with us about any questions or concerns that we have when we go into her office. I just love her and her office to pieces and appreciate how caring they are. I think it's gonna be very interesting to see the reactions that they're gonna have when I start doing some exercises to see if they really understand the risk that they have of heart disease and there's going to be some laughs, there's going to be some giggles and I hope to make it a fun exercise for them. I saw this on Facebook and my friend Barbara and I, we talk about, we talk every day and we decided to come to just find out, you know, what we could learn about staying healthy and eating right. The most important takeaway message that um, I want them to leave tonight with is heart disease is a real threat. You need to understand what your risk factors are, what your symptoms are, otherwise you are going to become a statistic. Be your own advocate. I'm hoping to learn more about her and see her. I mean, I don't know that I need a heart doctor right at the present time, but I am a diabetic and that affects her heart. So down the line, I might need her. I knew that we were gonna have a good group, but this is fantastic. But the more the merrier, no? The more people we have, the more we spread the word. And I'm anticipating that with the 400 people that are here tonight, we can at least cover another 2,000 people in the community as they go out and spread the word to the friends, families, mothers, sisters, and everybody else in the community. From the community to the state, from the state to the country, from the country to the world. Join Dr. Alvarez every second Saturday of the month for Walk to the Doc. Participants will enjoy a brief presentation on an important health topic, followed by a walk at your own pace led by Dr. Alvarez. You'll find more information for Walk with a Doc and the Tri-County Heart Institute when you click the Passion for Prevention story link icon online at yourhometownhealth.com.